Aunch Movies. Made it in, was that easy? Uh, no. No, we are spending more time on the garden today. Time to have your first wreck in a 12 passenger van. Flat Stanley's visiting all the way from Minnesota. This is the second biggest check I've ever written. One of my favorite points last week was serving with my Family. Oh, <laughs> well, we went to service last night, and this morning we are coming back to serve. Getting some drilling time in between helping. Our okay. first crowd is leaving Bye. pretty soon. Bye. And then we'll go work some more. And then you can have what? Is that why you came? No. <laughs> the twins are no longer in their infancy, so this is our new arrangement. How's it working? <laughs> Made it in. Was that easy? Uh, no. No. Carol0508 said, Your garden's looking great. Can't wait to see all the amazing fruits and vegetables that it will grow. And we are looking forward to doing that with you guys next week going to be a really fun part of our story that we're going to hang out with you guys. I found a huge room and it, and it was bigger. It was bigger. It was bigger. It was this big. We are spending more time on the garden today. Tim finished the plot. Now it is my job to finish up digging. You have pink eye. And Chloe's almost over it. Karis still has it. Where's Karis? And Toby wasn't feeling all that great earlier. Ooh, you want your toothbrushes? You want some jammies? Those are yours. These are for sister. Y'all ready to go night night? Sleep tight. We've been so great in the little minivan. Now we're, we started a new adventure to find a bigger vehicle. We are crammed in here and on our way to look for more space in our vehicle. Giant oh family. man, it's way bigger than our minivan. Time to have your first wreck in a 12 passenger van? I think it's <laughs> bus. It's so much bigger. I'm glad and you're driving. We, uh, this is gigantic. Yeah, way bigger than the van. I can't help but just to laugh at everything at this van because it's just gigantic. I think I just need to come to terms that I have a large family and I need to embrace the large family lifestyle. And I thought maybe you had to take this the turns a little wider. But you don't really have to. No, you can, it's completely normal. Yeah, you can turn, you can, from what I was experiencing looking in the mirrors, it looks like you can just drive it like our van. So. Yeah, this makes me nervous having another car coming. <laughs> <laughs> Stephanie Preston commented and said, You will get used to the big van. I was about in tears when we first got ours. It's gotten easier over time. That's good to hear. Glad to hear that. <laughs> Some of you guys were also commenting saying that, um, Backing up in the big van got easier over time. Just took some practice, took a little bit of getting used to, so we're looking forward to that. It has a backup camera, which is cool. Put it in reverse. And then you can kind of see Should when I you back up. Driveway? Driveway you try, it kind of predicts a little bit, I notice, when you're when you're backing up. So you can kind of see where like if oh, you turn. Center line? Yeah, but if you turn a little bit and it'll give you it'll predict know, where you're gonna kinda Well, adjust. you gotta turn more than that. No, it's, it's moving. I'm, oh, not, it? I'm not playing around with this thing. <laughs> Dana and I are wrapping up our evening by doing more research. Some of the cars we're looking at were rent, our rental cars. So we um wondering if buying a rental car, a former rental car, is a good idea. Sherry D commented at and said, we are in the market for buying a giant van soon. We have a seven passenger and have number six on the way, so time to upgrade. Where are you finding local resales on rentals? Are you just checking with each individual rental company or is there a specific website? I am having a hard time finding local options, but I know I am just not searching in the right place. Thanks. 
We just looked on Craigslist of what vans we wanted to look at were in the area, and then it just so happened because of the size of van that the ones that were used that we were finding happened to be rental vans. Apparently there's not too many, like anyone else buying these vans other than large families that keep them or rental companies that tend to get rid of them, so. Well, and rental companies can only keep them until so many mileages, right. so that's why you're able to find one with pretty good mileage still yeah. on it. My favorite part um, of this week was going to the butterfly exhibit, seeing a butterfly land on Plet Stanley's head. My my favorite part about going to the butterfly exhibit was like catching a bunch of butterflies and catching a huge blue butterfly. Flat Stanley's visiting all the way from Minnesota. So where are we taking her? To the butterfly exhibit. To the butterfly exhibit. I got one. You got one too, Hannah? Are they gonna talk and be friends? <laughs> I'm hoping that since Flat Stanley is so colorful, Flat Stanley will get a butterfly to land on her. So that's my goal today. Is hopefully Flat Stanley gets to catch a butterfly. Hannah! Hannah! Oh, it crawled on there. Hannah go? You got it. You got it. Flat Stanley has one on her <laughs> it's in my pocket. Here, I'll hold this. Wrong hand. I'll hold Flat Stanley. Flat Stanley's got one on her hand. Camera. I like sitting it in the belt seat by this window <laughs> in the van. <laughs> we have so much more room, now we have four more extra seats. So this dealership agreed to give us what we asked, what we're, our asking price for it, which is incredible, amazing. Dan has taken it around the block one more time. There's like a little bit of some kind of noise we're not familiar with. <laughs> so um, she's gonna take it around and the block and just see if it's still there because there's like a little bit of a creaking noise in the back. We think maybe it's just the, uh, it was the, the jack for the car wasn't locked down. So she's gonna take it around the block and see if that's really what it was. They had a second one of these vans. And so because of the creakiness of the first one, I'm out test driving the other one right now. And this one does not have any of that creakiness or anything else that the first one had. So, and pretty much everything else is the same, same mileage, same exact car, everything. So maybe we'll just get this one instead. We're gonna bring that gigantic thing home. Gigantic. The one with parts. This one, yeah. I am about to write a check for more money than I've ever written a check. And that's not true. When we bought our house, that was a bigger check. But other than that, this is the second biggest check I've ever written. And when you, like when I walked over, like I wasn't expecting for you to be like, so they dropped the price. Yeah, and well I stuck to my guns because they, they kept, you know, they, it's their job. Like they're supposed to, they're business people. They're supposed to give good value and. But I've heard of like people being like, just, just walk away or just act like you're gonna walk away. No, I actually was. Like I was gonna like, walk away from it because it wasn't. And we did the same thing with our minivan. Like we were actually gonna like, Okay, we're just gonna yeah. keep on looking, and, and it wasn't playing games or anything. But it was then like they, it wasn't in our budget. It's not what we said. Right, but then they so came back away. and they were like, "Well," and I was like, "Woo!" I was yeah, just, I didn't, didn't think we would actually spend all the money today. Yeah, so they gave us uh, the, the more expensive car for the same price as the other one, and uh, for the same same deal. Autobot Simmer asked the question. I think that's going through both of our heads right now, and maybe yours. They said, I'm loving these daily vlogs. Could you continue after after April? I don't know, we haven't talked about it yet. No, we haven't. There's a lot now. of work. It's a big commitment and uh, we love doing it with you guys. Uh, but I feel like we're we able gotta, to like flow our story better with you guys. Yeah, like, share we're what's thinking going about on. It all the time. Um, which I'm enjoying that of mm -hmm. like being able to continue our story better with you guys. That is harder when you do Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Yeah. Definitely. So 
but it does take a lot more time and it's a lot more time a lot more time away from the family and we're like a lot you know so it's fun but it comes with the cost and so we're trying to figure out that how, what we're going to do after april so we'd love to but we'll see we had a fun time with you guys this week we're looking forward to have a fun time with you guys next week especially for mom's birthday <laughs> yep, that was in the vlogs last week too, and now it's hopefully all better, right? All better? Pick Yep, it's all better. <laughs>